What's going on, guys? I've uh, I've been going through this real tough spot in um, in life for like the last week or so. Uh, my son, he he doesn't want to sit with me. He doesn't want to play with me. I mean, he'll go to the neighbor lady before he comes to me, and you know. And he'll come over and he'll laugh and, and, and look at me and, and touch me, but he doesn't, he doesn't want me to hold him, doesn't want me, you know, he, he just, he doesn't want to be in my presence. And though he shows me that he loves me, um, when I try to, to hold on to him, um, you know, when I try to take him out of his mom's arms or even out of the neighbor lady's arms, you know, he, he, he pulls away from me. And I'm not taking rejection from, from my son real well. You know, I, this morning I was really beat myself up about it, that he doesn't want anything to do with me. And, you know, it's like God almost quickened me, that here my son was showing, you know, that he knew, he knows who I am, he knows I'm, I'm father, and he displays some sort of love for me, but when it really comes to being in my presence and in, and in my arms, just chooses something else, and um, it's not always something that you know will harm him or or put him in danger. But it's something else, it's something other than the father. And it's like God just quickened my heart. How many times we choose something else? How many times when just being in the father's arms isn't what we want? And, uh, man, when God quickened my heart, I began to, to experience maybe a little bit of the sadness that maybe God feels when, when we choose someone or something else other than Him. And, you know, I, I don't know that God experiences rejection or not, um, but, but for me, it, it, it hurts. And, um, and if I see my relationship with God like that, Maybe it'll start driving me into his arms instead of just showing him a little bit of love and laughing and playing with him. But when it comes time to, to intimacy, choosing someone else or something else. So today, remember, God wants, God wants you in his arms. He wants intimacy with you. He wants you to choose him over everything else. He chose you, and He loved you before we could ever have loved Him. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later.